Okay, um, time for an iPhone tutorial, iPhone programming tutorial. We haven't done one of these for a while. So um, let me uh, load up my program here. Again, uh, the game I was working on, a uh, card battling game called uh, Battle Cards. And what I wanted to show you in this tutorial is the idea that instead of the program interface being uh, up and down like this, um, we're going to do like a like a landscape kind of thing like this and I want every um, screen of my program to to do that I don't want it to flip over like that alright I want it to uh, I want to have um, a correct layout for everything alright in, in this um, landscape mode and let me show you what happens what you have to do is first there's something you have to do in interface builder to accomplish this and there's also a couple pieces of code you have to put in and if you don't um, put the piece of code in uh, you're gonna get something that looks like this okay and that's not what you want obviously alright so let me show you what to do here um, in interface builder okay here's that um, tutorials uh, screen I was showing you so I'm gonna create a new one just to show you what to do here a new view Okay, so when you drag things in here, for example, if you drag something like this, you'll see that it's set up uh, for this vertical uh, view. Now, if we want to change it to like a horizontal view and have everything laid out correctly for the horizontal view, the uh, first thing we need to do is just click on this little arrow button here, and it will flip everything over. And it will handle all the layout for us. And once we've saved that file, um, then simply what we have to do next is, and we have to do this for... Um, every uh, every view we have that is going to be in this kind of uh, horizontal mode uh, for example this um, screen here that I showed you before which was the second screen we saw uh, choose your sorcerer okay so this um, screen here in its view controller dot m alright in the init with nim name function you have to add this section here, all right? I think it might be commented out. If it's commented, um, go ahead and uncomment it, and then add this here. Okay, if self equal, and you can go ahead and pause the video. Hopefully, I'm recording this in HD, so you should be able to see this. But basically, uh, inside the init with nib name, this code here, uh, init with nib name, and then in, inside of that, these two lines here will set everything uh, will rotate everything correctly so it doesn't do that weird thing that I showed you self dot view set center CG point make and then this 160 uh, 240 which is the center of the screen and then set dot view set transform CA CGA affine transform make rotation and then this weird uh, pi divided by 2 alright uh, and then down here Let's see, where is the next part? The other thing you have to do is uncomment Boolean should auto-rotate to interface orientation. And in this case, I just said return interface orientation equals 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 UI interface orientation landscape right. All right you have to do that for each one of these. So, for example, if you saw... Uh, let me go and bring up the tutorials view controller. As you see in the tutorials view controller, I I inserted in the init with nib name, I inserted the uh, code to rotate the interface, but I had not yet uncommented the should auto rotate uh, to interface orientation. And so when I click on that tutorials thing, it, it doesn't rotate the interface elements correctly. So I'm going to uncomment this. And... Um, UI interface, let me see here, where did I get that? UI interface, uh, interface orientation equals, I'll just copy this, and I will put that in here. Change it from portrait to right. I'll go ahead and build it. And now when we click on tutorial, everything is working hunky-dory the way we expected. Okay, and everything that we have done is, is doing that, and again, Everything that I had done had to have that uh, set up for it, okay? So uh, I hope that helps out.